This is V Sports in St. John's, Michigan. And today we are coming at you with a video of the brand new Lund 2075 Fisherman. This is the brand new uh, boat for the 2022 line. Did replace the Sport Angler and uh, has a lot of nice features in it for the uh, trolling type of fishing guy. Lots of drifting, uh, room in the back, all that kind of stuff. So we will show you a few things there. Um, swing tongue on the trailer. This is sitting on a Shorelander trailer. Does have the non-marking bow roller there. This one is in white and silver stone. Sport top is up as you can see there. Dual axle trailer. Standard graphics on this boat uh, for the typical fisherman. And on the back we do have a 200 horsepower Mercury. You can uh, do a 150 on this boat if you wanted to. Um, but we decided to go with the 200, a little more horsepower for some bigger water. And then you uh, have your pro kicker there, uh, which is the 15 horse. So you got both motors on the back there ready to go. Ladder off of the back, it is a full uh, extended ladder, not just the one that pops out of the back of the transom. A splash pan back here, gives you a little step to get into the boat, but um, kind of gonna mirror the uh, Thai Magnum. You'll see that when we get back inside. But just over 20 foot, actually just under 21 foot. Um, so nice big boat. This one is going to be all uh, vinyl. So in the front here, you got your storages. Storage in the front there for like your uh, foot pedal for your trolling motor or whatever. I'll get inside here and show you some of the storage. So this opens up, has all rubber gaskets, and this is a complete aluminum construction, which is nice. So the, the uh, no wood to rot. This side, storage, same thing, rubber gaskets. So a little difference about the, uh, one thing that sets this apart is going to be your, um, from your tie is gonna be the rod locker and the in-floor storage. So this is gonna be pretty nice here. So we'll hop down and show you the consoles. So your batteries are actually going to be stored uh, for your trolling motor are going to be underneath each console. So there's going to be a battery in here and also a battery under, batteries underneath there. You can go 36 volt on this. Um, so that's kind of your setup there. This is going to have where you, be where you put your rods for your rod locker. Again, rubber gaskets around the seals, which is nice. So usually the boat is either going to have one or the other, but the fisherman has enough storage for over 20 rods, 10 in there, 10 in the floor, and more in the sides, which we'll show you here in a second. Uh, but here's your dash. So you do have the radio in there, your simple switches, two controls for your motors, and the nice upgraded pilot's chair with the air ride. Uh, I'm sorry, the, the actually suspension seat. So a very nice chair in there. Side compartment storage, it's going to be, that's going to open up and allow you to store anything inside there. And the back side here is going to be your raised back end. So as you can see, there's a nice little uh, seat there and your rod storage underneath here is where your crank batteries are going to go underneath that console. So you already have the rod holders that come with it. This side of the seat folds down along with this side, but this is what it looks like when it is up. So if you are fishing, um, you know, trolling and trying to reel in a fish off the back, you can lean up against that, which is really nice. Cup holders back here. And then you have your live well with bait net, divider, all that kind of stuff. So perfect setup for, uh, you know, the trolling guys, um, again, you can kind of see we have some side storage here as well. So on the side, this one is going to have your rod holders that go up into the uh, spots there. And the Lund ruler, of course, that comes with it. So you have the extra seat here, passenger seat, give you a little overview of the front. And then we also have the in-floor storage. So we'll go ahead and open that up so you can see that. Just like the Taiyi, 
here's your travel cover there. And then you have the 10 rod storage in the bottom of the floor here. Perfect boat for any sort of trolling activities. Like I said, lots of room for drifting. Kind of give you an overview of the whole boat here. So there is large cockpit area. Lots of room for lots of guys if you're trolling with lots of friends. Again, this is the 2075 Fisherman, brand new in 2022. If you'd like to check this boat out, have any questions, give us a call at 800-233-7720, or you can visit our website and see this boat along with our other inventory at www.bees-sports.com.